up north and one person is reported death of the clashes between supporters of the National Democratic Congress and a new patriotic party in Chiponi district in the northern region on Monday, December 5, 2016. Five other persons sustained serious gunshot wounds and were sent to the Chiponi I want to fall in to speak with ASP Ebenezer Theta. He is a PRO, police PRO up north. Good afternoon, sir, and thanks for your time. Good afternoon. Now, what is the current situation there now in Chiponi? Uh, presently, uh, police deployment, uh, reinforcement from Yendi uh, arrived uh, early this morning in the Chiponi township. So, since they arrived, the police has been calmed. And have any arrests been made? Not yet. So what has been done to get even the citizens' help with arrest? Uh, yes, uh, uh, a criminal uh, offence application. And definitely uh, there may be uh, arrests. We are going to effect arrests. Uh, because of the fact that the situation was not conducive yesterday for an, an arrest, we did not move into arrest. Because yesterday it was chaotic. It was... Uh, uh, class between the MPP supporters and the, the NDC supporters, and um, it came with a throwing of stones and uh, you know firing from both sides. So the best thing for us to do is to de-escalate the situation and bring the situation under control. And now that the, uh, the situation has died down and things are calm, um, we will now be acting on intelligence and uh, uh, the people behind this uh, attack that has resulted in the death of two persons uh, will have to be you know, arrested so that they will, they will face the law. Now, according to what we had, the clash was between National Democratic Congress and the New Patriotic Party supporters up north. What really triggered this? And can you confirm if indeed that was what happened? I didn't get a question. Where Are you saying that uh, the two parties held the rallies at both uh, at the same location? Is that I, the I'm asking what really triggered the clash up north. We're told that it was between the National Democratic Congress and the New Patriotic Party supporters. Yeah, they, they, they had both held their rallies at uh, two separate locations. Uh, MPP had their rally at Wenchiki, whilst NDC had their rally at Wenjuga. Uh, the rally itself you know, ended successfully, peacefully, because uh, we were informed and we made arrangements uh, in respect of the, 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 the two rallies. But it was unfortunate, just after the rally, both of them came to town you know, in a jubilant mood, shooting of horns and uh, in, a, in a convoy. And it was unfortunate they met, you know, at the uh, same location. They crossed each other's path and um, it triggered, you know, a clash between the two sides. They were initially separated, but after they, they were separated, they regrouped, armed themselves and clashed again, this time around midnight. So that was when uh, the police had to call for a reinforcement from Yendi to come in. And uh, the reinforcement arrived from Yendi, uh, by which time most of the people and who were caught up in this uh, confusion had, uh, you know, run away. Now, looking at what has happened in the past, especially when it comes to Chiponi, what is the plan by your outfit, especially for Election Day? How many men will be deployed to that very area? Uh, yes, uh, we we will. What we have to do tomorrow is to ensure that uh, people come out in their numbers to vote. With what has happened, uh, there will be fear in the area. So ours is to ensure that uh, enough security is sent to the guy, and that is exactly what the regional police command is doing. And can you uh, tell us about how we, many men will be deployed there? Uh, for security reasons, uh, I will not be able to give you the exact figures, but I, 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 I want to assure you that it's on our radar, and we are going to ensure that. Uh, the atmosphere is created for people to come out to cast their vote, and that will do without any fear of fever, you will or affection. Anybody who will try to disturb the peace of the area tomorrow, uh, as a result of what has happened, take advantage to embark on any with other attacks, uh, that person will have to be dealt with in accordance with the law.
Well, I asked because from the information we gathered, it took an hour. The clash lasted for almost an hour with the police unable to control the, cloud, um, the crowd in there and when the situation was happening there. Yes, uh, and if you know the geography of the area, if you know the geography of the area, you understand that if men, reinforcement have been called from Yendi to Tripani, from Yendi to, to Tripani, it's, it's, uh, it's, it's, it's quite a journey. So um, initially when it happened, the police were able to bring the situation under control. This time around, they reorganized and they clashed again. So the reinforcement that was called, yes, it took them some time to get to uh, uh, Tripani. I cannot confirm whether it took them an hour or more, but it, it will definitely take them some time because from Tripani to Yendi, is quite a journey. Well, thank you very much, um, ESP Beniza, that uh, he is a PRO for Northern Region.